This is an animal that's been in countless movies, loves your bath and has been in at least one of your nightmares. Here are 10 things you probably didn't know about spiders. Number 10. Spider silk is stronger than steel. Pound for pound, spider silk is five times stronger than steel. Scientists have always known that the silk from a spider was strong, but with advancements in technology we now know why. Using the atomic force microscope it is now possible to analyse their webs in micro detail, revealing that a single strand is made up of multiple parallel nanostrands that measure an astonishing one micron, 50 times as long as they are wide. These minute flat ribbons have been notoriously difficult to recreate synthetically, but now we understand them a little more, the near future may see us unraveling the strongest natural material the world has ever seen. Go web! Number 9. Spiders skip leg day at the gym. Instead of muscles in their legs like you or I, spiders rely on blood pressure, or hemolin for spider blood is actually called, that fills their legs so that they can extend them similar to how we use fluids in hydraulic machinery. This all sounds like an evolutionary flaw, but most spiders are able to jump using a technique where they put their leg joints under high pressure, and then by releasing this pressure the legs extend instantly like a spring that fires them into the air. The lack of extensor muscles means that when the spider dies and the heart stops beating, the legs are curled inwards by the force of their flexor muscles and this is known as a death curl. Number 8. Spiders are true royals. You may have heard the phrase royalty has blue blood, well if this is the case then all spiders are royalty. Humans have iron in their blood to form haemoglobin, and when oxygen binds with this molecule it creates oxyhemoglobin, which absorbs all colours of the spectrum but reflects red. Spiders, along with snails and octopus, don't use haemoglobin to transport blood around the body, Instead, they make hemocyanin that employs copper atoms instead of iron, and oxyhemocyanin absorbs everything but blue, giving it the appearance of a blue colour. The reason the blood in your veins looks blue when viewed through the skin is because skin doesn't absorb blue light as well as it does red, and this is reflected and our veins appear to be blue. Number 7. The odds are in our favour. There are around 46,000 species of spider that we have discovered and documented so far but only 12 of these are dangerous to humans. The most dangerous of these is the Brazilian wandering spider, which bites hundreds of people every year, and if it wasn't for powerful anti-venom that would mean hundreds of deaths. If you live in the USA then you're probably familiar with the Black Widow, and whilst it is responsible for many spider bites, 1,015 cases in 2018, it only kills an average of around 6 people a year, and most don't require medical treatment. Number 6. The Vegan Spider the Bagheera Kiplingi is a vegan, mostly, and it's named after Rudyard Kipling, the famous author responsible for the Jungle Book. The genus name is taken from the panther in the very same book, and the species name is in honour of Rudyard Kipling himself. 90% of their diet consists of the leaf nubs of acacia trees, from which they gain proteins and sugars. It will sometimes steal ant larvae from worker ants, and has been known to commit to cannibalism. It also has a sweet tooth and is known to slurp up nectar from special nectar producing glands on the tree branches. Whilst you're there, why don't you click the like and subscribe buttons down below, and click the notification bell so you don't miss out on my next 10 things. You may also leave a comment below and suggest a topic you want to hear about in this series. Number 5. Spiders are never far away. Approximately 1 million spiders live in one acre of land, and in tropical regions this can increase to 3 million. It is said that you are never further than 10 feet away from a spider. Don't believe me? Test it out for yourself. Even if you can't see them, there will be 8 eyes watching you from some dark corner of your room. Number 4. Spiders keep pets. Narrow mouthed frogs, or micro hylids, are spread over several continents and contain 570 species. This frog species has been adopted by tarantulas, even though it could easily become a light snack for them. Tarantulas can detect chemical cues that allow it to identify the frogs so they don't end up as dinner. Living in the spider's burrow, and even venturing out alongside them, the frogs get protection and in return they will eat ants and other invertebrates and parasites that are a danger to the spider's eggs and young. You scratch my back and I'll scratch yours.
Number 3. Tarantulas have paws. At the end of each leg of a tarantula are two or three retractable claws like cat paws. These claws enable them to climb up many surfaces like trees and walls. They also have a set of hairs that help them grip better on certain surfaces such as glass. If you keep a pet tarantula then you will want to make sure it has a tight fitting lid or you could have one wandering around your home. Number 2. Spider Venom is a Painkiller As we all know spider venoms contain proteins and polypeptides and with a little tinkering by scientists these can be isolated and used to help humans instead of hindering them. Some of the peptide toxins in spider venom can be used to kill tumour cells in cancer victims or others can be effective painkillers. It was reported in Medical News Today that researchers investigated a peptide from a spider's venom on mice and concluded that the molecule zeroed in on the receptors that cause epilepsy in humans. Number 1. Spiders are our greatest fear The world's number one animal related fear is arachnophobia and between 3 and 15% of the population are said to have some form of it, but recent surveys showed out of 118 patients in a study, 75% of them was afraid of spiders. If you're one of these people then you might want to know that spiders hate the smell of citrus fruits, tea tree oils and vinegar, and keeping these smells in your home will deter spiders completely. Even though spiders are almost colorblind, studies have shown that green is their favorite color. Wearing green and having green items around your home will attract them. Their least favorite color is light blue. I don't know about you, but I think it's time to decorate. As spiders are one of humanity's greatest fears, Hollywood has taken note and there are many movies out there that give you spider chills. Spiders are known to be so scary that in the 1962 James Bond film Dr. No swapped out the centipede scene for a spider because at the time your average person had no idea that centipedes were indeed more terrifying. If you want to watch more of my top 10 things or my 5 minute videos about various creatures then why not hop along to my channel and check them out. Thanks for watching.